Hey everybody, this is Heidi for Blitzy, and in today's video, I'm gonna walk you through how to make fun and easy two color macrame bracelets. In front of me here, I've got two pieces of hemp cord that are about four feet long. I folded them both at the one foot mark and got these two little bunny ears to work with. I'm gonna attach the purple cord to the blue cord with a lark's head knot by wrapping it around the blue cord and pulling the tails through the loop. Once we do that, our project will be set up and ready to start knotting our two color bracelet. So there you go, the lark's head knot around the blue string. Now I'm gonna use this handy project board to keep my work in place. I've got this loop pinned through the top and I'm going to pin this knot by piercing it with a pin and locking it in place. Now we're gonna take our two shorter pieces of string and have them run down the middle of our project board. Next, I'm gonna take the blue string and tie my first knot for this bracelet. This is called the half hitch knot. So we bring it behind those middle strands, like so and then we bring it over the front of the middle strands and back through itself to form the first knot. Now we'll grab our purple string on the right hand side and do the mirror image of that for the other half hitch. We'll bring the end behind those middle strands and then back through the loop. So these kind of look like cursive E's that are facing each other. See that cursive E right there? And then pull to tighten. So as you work down your bracelet, you'll simply alternate making blue knots on the left hand side, like this, looking for that cursive E, and purple knots on the right hand side, Again, as we tighten, always look for that cursive E. And as we work, these two knots that face each other interlock in a ladder style that's really, really attractive um, as jewelry or zipper pulls. And I'm gonna keep working down my bracelet, forming these two color half hitch knots until the bracelet is long enough to fit around my wrist. All right. Now I've tightened my last knot, and now this bracelet is long enough to fit all the way around my wrist. Now I can unpin my work from my project board and trim the extra tails of string that I don't need. So when you're all finished, you've got yourself a colorful bracelet, but if you don't wanna quite commit to a full bracelet, you can also make yourself a nifty zipper pull.